Chrome OS Flex is Google's lightweight version of Chrome OS, which is designed to run on older PCs and laptops. Unfortunately, Chrome OS Flex doesn't come with Android app or Google Play Store support. But don't worry. In this step-by-step -step guide, I'll show you exactly how you can unlock the Google Play Store on Chrome OS Flex by installing the full version of Chrome OS. This process is not officially supported, but it works well if done right. So let's dive in. First things first, let's make sure your system is compatible. Not all CPUs can run Chrome OS. You need to have an Intel CPU from 6th gen or newer, or an AMD Ryzen processor. Unfortunately, older CPUs, ARM processors, and computers without integrated GPUs won't be supported for this process. If your device meets these requirements, we can proceed. And remember, always back up your data before we begin as this process will wipe your current operating system. Now we'll start by downloading the Chrome OS recovery image. Head over to the Chrome OS recovery image link provided in the video description below. Different images are available depending on your CPU. If you have an Intel 6th or 9th gen processor, download the Ramus image. For Intel 10th gen or newer, download the Voltior image. And for AMD Ryzen processors, you'll need the Zork image. I have an Intel Core i3 9th gen processor, so I'll download the Ramos image. After downloading the image, rename the file by adding .bin at the end, so that the Chromebook recovery utility can recognize it. Next up, you need to create a bootable USB drive with the Chrome OS recovery image we just downloaded. To do this, go to the Chrome Web Store. Search for Chromebook Recovery Utility. Install the extension. After installation, launch it and follow the steps. Insert a USB drive with at least 16 GB of storage. Then. Click the gear icon and select Use Local Image. Select the Chrome OS image we renamed earlier. Select the USB drive and follow the prompts to create the bootable USB. It will take 5 to 10 minutes. The Chrome OS bootable USB is ready. Now it's time to install Chrome OS on your PC. Restart your PC and access the BIOS settings. Once in the BIOS, disable Secure Boot under the Boot or Security tab, depending on your system. After that, ensure that virtualization is enabled. Now exit BIOS and access your boot menu. Select your bootable USB from the boot menu and press Enter. The system will now boot into Chrome OS from the USB. Loading branch framework screen takes a bit of time, so be patient. Once you see the Chrome OS logo, press Ctrl plus Alt plus F2 to open the terminal. Now let's install Chrome OS onto your hard drive. In the terminal, type root to login. Run the command isblk e7 to see your available storage drivers. Look for the main hard drive partition where you will install Chrome OS. In my case, it's labeled as NVMe0N1. Once you have identified your drive, run the following command. At the end, make sure to type your current hard drive name. The installation can take around 10 to 15 minutes. Once it's done, you'll see the Chrome OS installed message. Now, to exit terminal, press Ctrl plus Alt plus F1 on your keyboard. After that, shut down your computer, remove the USB drive and then power it on. The system will automatically boot into the Chrome OS you just installed. Just follow the prompts to finish the initial setup of your Chrome OS.
you have successfully installed chrome os on your device now head to the google play store to make sure everything is working as expected if it all went well you now have a full chrome os with google play store on your pc this opens up a world of possibilities with android apps on your pc or laptop and there you have it you have successfully transformed your chrome os flex into a full fledged chrome os system with google play store